opportunity. There is no amount of tears you will shed that will assuage the evil you brought upon this kingdom. You must be buried alive to save the entire Ububara kingdom. Please, <laughs> don't let them kill me! Don't let them kill me! I believe her. I believe you will not allow a stranger to lay you. <laughs> hey, imbecile! Don't wish you lay hand on her. Do not allow your fake feelings for her to cloud your sense of judgment. No one should lay hand on her. Don't beat yourself against the god. You have to kill me before you get to her. You have to kill me first. Imbecile! You only have one chance to drop that weapon or face the wrath of the gods. And you! The gods have already judged you for impersonating their own. Who are you? We are the Inato, offspring of Oseblua. You tried to kill us, but the gods spared our lives. Liars! Your highness, they are lying! The real Inato usually wear masks. I forbid you! This? You do not call the gods liars. Iwe, Iwe, please go for me. Let's confess. Please, please, no, no confess. show you that the end of a tortoise is hot water. I told you to leave that land, but you will not listen. You thought you were a warrior. You are not a warrior. It was your great grandfather that was a warrior, not you. I would show you. Finish him off. Ugunda, please take the land. Finish him. Take the land. Take the land. Ah! You have killed my own father. Ah! Catch him. Go for him. Catch him. Shed blood and no more your kingdom. Let's go back. I think, I think we lost them. Yes, 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 I yes, 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 Let's let's rest somewhere around here. Yes, By yes. morning, find out. Yes, yes. Come, 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 come.
Guys, gue kok, gue kok, gue Ya, wih, lihat tuh Gue mau sleep ya, let's let go Greetings from Osebloa Now three sons of Okonum The son of Udense The offspring of a great hunter from Ezio Wale clan of Ababa Kingdom Do not be afraid Who are you? I am Ani. I was here before the earth was formed by Oseblowa. I am he that was and he that is. The essence of all being. If the earth should cease to be, I will return to Oseblowa and become the beginning of all beginnings. <laughs> nice one. We're, we're, we're sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're very sorry. We, we, we never knew we, we ran into the temple of the gods. I mean, we we only seek shelter from those who seek our lives. <laughs> Please, wise one, we're, we're, we're sorry. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. I am aware. It is the wish of Oseblowa that the three of you will be here so that you will be able to fulfill your destiny. Destiny? The journey of your lives has just begun. Wise one, you confuse us. Please, can you speak in a clear language so we can understand you? Please. Yes. Yeah, yes. Yes, wise one. Make us understand. Please. We understand. Yes. My children. See. See, see, see. The hearts of the children of men have become so evil. Greed and shedding of blood have become the order of the day in the midst of men. But I, Annie, the great deity of the earth, has come to purge it of all evil. What do you have us to Your destiny. Your destiny is who you are. And what Osebulu and my father has made you to be. You are going to remain here for the next 12 nights. So that you will be purified to carry out the services of Osebulu. My We can stay here. Night. Our parents lay dead in the hut, waiting to be buried. Yes, you expect us to stay here. Sons of Osebloa, I am sorry for your fate, but you must allow death to bury the dead. This is ridiculous. Yes. Now listen, old man. Our parents lay dead out there, and you expect I and my brothers. To lay here for 12 nights, it's not going to work. Ilochi, Ekene, let's leave this place. Yes. <laughs> Your <laughs> heart with your self blower. What is it? Let's go now. I can't move my legs. I can't move my legs. Why do you I can't move my legs. Your heart are sealed. Even before <laughs> the three of you saw the earth. I can't move my legs. Why do you I can't move my legs. Why do you Why do you Annie gives life. Annie do not take life. Then let him go. Let us go if you do not take life. Yes, sir. Not until you are purified and empowered for the services of Usebloa. Your adversaries await your return. But if you can render your services to Usebloa, you will be empowered to avenge the death of your parents. <laughs> Next one. Please, please. Just clear our brother. Yes, what yes. do you want us to do? Yes, we'll what do, do we do? Anything, anything. Bring my brother up. Anything. Eat my queer and you are better. Eat my queer and you are better. You have a pentad American. You have a pentad American. You have a pentad American. Hey, 
I am now sending you to be judges over all nations. You have powers to dictate evil. And upon anyone you see evil, such a person will face the law of the land. But on no condition will any human see your faces. Because if they do, you will lose your powers. And it will take you six market days to restore it with constant supplications. Why do you want to poison your brother because of his wife? What nonsense are you talking about? Nonsense, you see. Please, I swear by the spirit, if you save my life, I will serve you truly forever. Please. You're begging for life. I'm here to seek for another. You hate Jerica. You hate Jerica. It is said that the storm of life follows the corpse into the grave. Any day I see your fate on that land, it is your carcass that will be carried. Your carcass will be carried. Father. Father. Must you kill her? Must you? You want to kill her because she's fighting you for what is hers? Must you? What do you What do you know? Hey! Today is the fourth day that I have waited for him here. Does it mean that he no longer passes through this route to Ezin Naya? Or he does not go hunting anymore?
Greetings to you, son of the earth, offspring of the lion. Blessed day to you, daughter of the earth. Blessed day it is, for the gods have granted me the privilege to behold your face. Forgive me, I do not understand what you mean. For days, I've longed to see your handsome face. And today, the gods have granted me that wish. What for? Why will you long to see my face? Of what difference is the face? I mean, is it different from every other faces you're seeing in Obubara Kingdom? Ah, Ibezim, that is not a good thing to say to a friend who only wishes you well. You are not. Say what you want. Are you trying to say we are not friends? Anyway, I made venison. Will you come and dine with me? Please. I am sorry. I do not have time. I'm a very busy man, as you can see. Then let's go now. Isn't Nami is not far from here? It took me a great deal to prepare that just for you. Hmm. Please do not turn it down. Like I said before, I cannot be your guest today. I am a very busy man. Please, even if it's just for a moment, mm -hmm. I would so much appreciate it. Please. <laughs> do not be afraid, my beautiful maiden of Obubara Kendo. <sighs> to be honest with you, I don't have anywhere going. I will be glad if I be your guest. Please. <laughs> Let me hang on your neck there for saying that rubbish to me. It's just an offer. I'll be happy if I be your guest. At least I don't have anywhere going. <laughs> but I had everything you said. <laughs> hmm. Nine. Now give me this the small one now. This small one. Take it from your hand. Let me let me do your own. This small one you gave him now, you're calling names from the small village. Greetings, the family of Fugumba. Offerings of a lion. Greetings, your highness. Welcome, my princess. Greetings to you too, and peace be to you. Most beautiful daughter of Abu Barak Kingdom. <laughs> Please sit. Thank you. Ha, ah, my princess, mm. you're welcome. Thank you. Your chi is ever faithful. They never cease to adorn you with beauty in breaking day. <laughs> Thank you, Ne. Your chi never ceases to do a great job in you too. Even in your old age, your beauty can still awaken dead man. Ah. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Let me feel your eh? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. you're awfully silent. What happened? Please, don't pry on my being. My chair and I know what we're going through. Uh. What is wrong with him? Did I say anything bad? Uh, don't worry, my princess. Let me go and talk to him and see what is wrong. Offer her something to me. I'll be back. Who's over there? I'm a speaker. Let me kill your range. Is that range? You are so, talking about your range, really. Uh -huh. Let me kill your range. Uh -huh. Are your parents? Uh -huh. Why does he not look at me? Am I not beautiful enough? Or is my father not one of the honorable men of this kingdom? What else does he want in a maiden that the gods did not bless me with? Yet each time I reach out for him, he turns me down. Jide. Jide, why are you doing this to yourself? Eh? Why don't you calm down and do not tell me to calm down, Ebiri? My chin seems to be at lost, for my talent is soaked with anger and hatred. But love is all I see. Each time I want to vent my anger on him. You see? You see what I'm saying? Eh? Your heart says another why your head says otherwise. So why don't you listen to your heart and not your head? I am lost without him. 
I love him. But, but, there is no but. Yes, there is no but. Don't give up. Keep pushing. Keep trying. I know that someday, very soon, he will see the true woman in you. Are you sure about that? Yes, I am very, very sure. Yes, yeah, smile for me. Um, you don't want to smile, I will go. I'll just go back to you. Come here, you know you're my best friend. <laughs> Don't worry, hmm? everything will be fine very soon. I know that. Oh, my princess, feel so good with you. <laughs> so, how's your father? Oh, there he comes. Oh, my lady. Hunt here! Sorry, Nai. Uh, oh. I've been waiting. I'm so sorry for keeping you waiting. Anyway, not for so long. Mm -hmm. So how was hunting today? The gods has did that which they deem fit for the day. Hmm. I take it you did not catch any spot today. <laughs> Whatever. Oh, come, let me. Let's take a walk. Well, I made us meal at the palace. Hmm. So straight to the palace. I'm already celebrating. Long shirt. <laughs> has been so kind the gentle breeze whispering to our ears that the day will get better exactly my daughter Amadio has indeed blessed us with his benevolence and faithfulness <laughs> greetings your highness welcome son of Ugumba how is your father he's there with his chief everyone with his chief none carries another she with him <laughs> you are right, Father. But I must leave you to continue your rest. It's okay. <laughs> this is a disgrace on our son. How can the princess choose a son of a widow tree over my own son? On my mail, it won't happen. Ha! What baffles me is that I don't even know what route Ibe's embedded himself in that will make the princess reject and ditch my son, Uzube, every time he shows his face before her. Go and find it, though. You better go and find that route. Because I won't see it and allow the princess to marry another person instead of my son. Oman Mekwa. Oman Meo, I won't allow you to. Don't worry yourself. Yeah. Don't worry. Mm. I will deal with this. I will solve this. That is what you always say, I will solve. I will solve, I will solve. And you end up not solving anything. Please try and solve this one. Just give me time, I will. Ha! Oman Mekwa. Ibiri. The only thing that can make it right is when it doesn't become mine. But his heart is fixed on another. His heart is fixed on another. How did you know his heart is fixed on another? Eh? Hey? If no woman occupies his heart, then why is he not looking at my way? You see? Someone is there and I ask, is that maiden 
more beautiful or more blessed than I am? Tell me. No. Then what do I lack? I'm asking you, what do I lack? You have every gift of the gods. And that's why I appreciate Amadio for allowing me to associate with you, my love. <laughs> my love, you know I'm the one who is privileged to have you. Every maiden in this land wants you. But you chose me over them. Yes, because my heart found peace in you. <laughs> my cheese at rest whenever you're with me. My stomach rumbles whenever you call my name. Hmm. I feel butterflies inside of me whenever you hold me. <laughs> you are mine and I'm yours. Thank you. I made it myself. Test it. This is really good. Are you sure you're the one who made this? Yes. I see you like it. Yeah, yes. You better join me before I finish it. Go ahead. <laughs> mm. This is good. Mm -mm. Mm. Greetings, Your Highness. Princess! I salute the day for being so kind to you. And the night for allowing you to find rest in it. And your cheek for being so faithful to you. Daughter, a father's prayer for his children is for their days to be long. May your days be longer than that of the tortoise. It's a... May your too, father. What makes the princess of Obobara so happy this day? <laughs> father, my heart is at rest with my cheek. For I know what the moon that follows the day holds for me. You speak of your fine young man, the son of Ichil. Ugumba. Does he feel the same way you feel for him? For you? Even the cricket that whistles at night knows that his love for me is as strong as Ochoko Mountain or Ojibak. <laughs> like I said, he is a fine young man. And his father, an honorable man of this kingdom. Hmm. I see you're about taking a stroll with uh, your maidens. Yes, Father. You please be quick to come back before night falls. Thank you, Father. Thank you, my dear. Mm. Thank you. Okay. My good princess. to stop. I want Princess Akuchi to marry my son. The seed which she loves is your seed. And I speak not of that seed. I speak of Uzube, my son. He's the one I want to marry Princess Akuchi. Do whatever you can to make that happen. Does the river flow backwards? No! The earth shall gather for that to happen. 
Then gather the head, the great Oswabani. Gather the head. Do you want me to feel the vultures with your flesh? The vultures knows no shame in its name. Hmm. And that is why it's pride itself. I've come to warn you to tell that you useless soul to stay away from my compound. You know that your seventh and ninth generation cannot do what you just said to this family. You can't do it. I am not here to trade words with you, but to tell you, to tell that your useless son, to stay away from my heart if you still want him to see the next day. Okay. Come on, get out from here so Thanks. you don't stay away from my compound. Get out! Look at this rejected land. Son of a wretch. Nyala. He's the way my Hey, 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 Ejido! Ejido! What are you doing on my time? Huh? Have I not warned you to stay away from my plan land with your cosplay? Huh? Shemba, I am my son are dying of hunger. Please allow us to have some young. You are dying of hunger? Is that why you are stealing on my land? Come to think of it, this land belongs to my late husband. Eh? Do you want to starve us to death? Yes. I want to starve you to death. Since you have chosen to deprive me of what rightly belongs to me. Yes. You know, according to the custom of this land, once your husband, my brother, die, I will inherit everything that belongs to him, including you. Huh? Huh? Yes. Including me. Uh -huh. I. Mua. <laughs> huh? mm. How possible is it that you inherit a mother and hate this man? Mm -hmm. eh? You inherit me. Then what happened to my son? This, this, this is your son. Is is the bane in you? Huh? Eh? Is the bane. Get him! 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 I will send him to slavery. Then your sense come back, will come back. Come back. Come you know back. that come that's the only thing you need. Come back. Come back. We will carry along. Come for me. Take, take. If you if you do take. anything, I will kill you. Monster. Speak, and I'll show you how to alleviate the pain. <laughs> 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 
speak, father. speak to me. Come on, speak. Mbogo! Mbogo! What is this shouting? Man? Did you give me the medi Medi et gather its dust on your household if you do not go and get this woman's son right now. Nay, what is it that he's speaking of? What have you done to her son? Your husband here is pure evil. He has taken this woman's least husband's property, including the last land she got. And you have also taken this woman's son. I know you want to sell him to the slavery. I see that the spirit of Iberibe has taken hold of you. Who are you threatening? Mbogo! Odogu Mbogo! I am not threatening you. I am telling you to go and get that boy now. Before I send it to your ancestors. You will regret this. I assure you that. You will regret it. Nice. I beg you in the name of the God. We don't you're, back her son. You're telling my patient, right? Uh, 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 woman. Shut your mouth. Go and get, go and get him now. Shoot him. Get him. Greetings, beautiful maiden. Greetings, Ichi. Are you here to see my husband? Uh, well, well, no. Um, I'm here to see you. Uh, I did not know that a beautiful maiden like you exists and lives in this clan. What is your name? I do not understand. What do you mean by a beautiful maiden exists in this clan? Ichi, what do you want? Nothing. I just want to know your name so that I can at least thank the gods for creating a beautiful creature like you in this place. So, what is your name? My name is not important to you. Please, do not come back to this hut again because my husband will not like it. For the river needs not more than it has already. <gasps> your husband must be a very lucky man to have a beautiful maiden loyal to him. What a shame. All I wanted to do was to make friends with you. Who knows? I, Ichi Ugumba, the Lion of Obubara, may just very well take care of you and everything that concerns your husband. Thank you. But we do not need it. Very soon, you will need my help. Go to your mother. She will not trouble you again. May the gods be with you. May the gods be with you too. You're so kind and brave, unlike your father. Ah, my father. My father is who he is, and I'm who I am. Although Seblu created both of us, but I'm, I was made out of his loins. Um, I have my own chi that beats the music that I dance. <laughs> so does he. You're right, my son. May this your kind-heartedness be your source of escape in the time you of... Say, I will take my leave now. Go on, my son. Stay well. May the girls smile their face of countenance on you. Huh. Ghost of our land, I thank you. Ichi Ogumba, how long will it take you to tie your son Ibezim to the confine of your home? Eh? You allowed him to upset everything we work for and live for. Ogumba, eh? listen. When a child bites his mother's nipple without a slap, your child gets the wrong impression that the mother is smiling to the punishment. You have to do something. And, and, and this is the last time we are warning you about this. 
If he don't do anything, eh? Then you lose him to him. Hey, you know the funny thing is that both of you are not more eager than I am. Eh? Yes, I have tried to remove him out of existence, to pack him back to his chief. Hmm? But on about him. Hey. Oh. Then you, you seek the help of Night Bar. Mm -hmm. Also a ballet. Eh? They're all powerful. They can help you here. Like I told you, you are not more eager than I am. I have tried that already. And they told me that his pact with Ongu has not reached. Hey! I believe it. Mm. Ah. <laughs> There's nothing I haven't tried. Don't come here. Keep it safe. Keep it safe. You have grown bigger than us now. Why do you like to consign yourself with things that do not have anything to do with you? Why would you just allow the sleeping dogs lie? Let me tell you, that fire is aggressive, does not mean we can put water to flight. Oh. You are putting your chest like this, Hunter. How many lions have you killed? How many tigers have you killed? I do not understand what you mean by that, Father. I can't understand. But if it concerns Ichi Mbogo, then I will do it again. The fire might not put water to a flight, but it can change the water by turning its cold nature to hot. Oh, I see. You want it to be the poison that will pack you back to your chick. Be warned. Stop concerning yourself with what you do not know. Hunter. Nay, why are you disturbing yourself? A stubborn fly follows the corpse to the grave. When a dog chases an unarmed man, he suffers false feelings of being a wolf. If Ichimbogo is a strong man with strong balls in between his tiles, then he should face me squarely. <laughs> So which spirit is beating the drum that is dancing? What other spirit but death? It is only death that can beat that kind of drum that has a sound. Kokoma, koma, kokoma, koma. By way, by way, naya na. It will soon happen. Which song is that one? It's death song. <clears throat> you were saying that. Ichi Ogumba came to this place. Looking for what? I don't know. I don't know. He said he was hoping that we could become friends. Can you imagine? Is that how men from this land behave? <laughs> Is that right? Just be careful with that man. Do everything possible to avoid that man. That man is evil. Yes. It's obvious. But you better warn him. Warn him, no. Hmm. Warn him. Because the next time he tries his rubbish, I'll disgrace him that day. My love, you don't need to worry yourself. I will make sure he doesn't come here to disturb you again. Warn him. Just cheer up, okay? Warn him. I will. Warn him. <laughs> okay. Don't worry, I will. You are looking beautiful. Greetings, my princess. Thank you, Judy. How is your father? He's fine. I understand that. You know, I once told you that every maiden in this kingdom wish you were there. 
This is the way she behaves. I'm sure it's because she wants you. Hmm. That the dog love mate, that does not make elephant his prime target. The whole maiden in this kingdom can wish what they want, but I choose who I will love, and that person is you. Only if you can allow me to take you to the moon. <laughs> and as your princess, I command you to love me to the moon. Mother, hmm? you and father lied to me. You promised me that the princess would be mine. Instead, ever since you made that first promise to me, the princess love over uh, Ibezim keep growing stronger. Eh? Why are you talking like this? Eh? A promise made is a promise that we will keep. Eh? We will make you king. You will be a king in this kingdom. Forget about what you're saying. You know your brother lives a false life. Leave that thing. He's not doing anything. Mother, eh? stop making promises you can't keep. Eh? Can't you look into her eyes and see that she's lost for Ibezim? Into her eyes? Yes. Then you forgot that the princess's eyes is never straight. It might be that something entered her eyes and she looked that way. So that thing will go out. I hope you're here, dear Lanya. Eh? And you now call that her eyes is fixed on him. Don't worry. If it's the eyes that is your problem, I will move the eyes and the body and they will be looking at you. You will be a king. You will make it king, Globuda. Trust but, your mother. Uh, that, that's how you people keep promising me every day, every day. We can look quick and negate. Have faith like your mother. Be brave. Ma, don't know. Ha, ha. Princess, I, that, I will move her to you. You will be a king. That is how it is. Greetings, Mr. Ugumba. Greetings. I also greet you, Achi, for standing so resolute by your side. Salutations, son of Bobara. My wife told me that you visited our east yesterday. She also told me what you discussed with her. Please, Ichi, I beg you in the name of the courts of the land, leave her alone for me. She is the only one I have. Besides, we just got married. Uh, forgive me, son. I did not know she was your wife. I mean, I just saw the beautiful maiden of our land, and her face was strange to me. So I decided in my benevolence to make friends with her. But she wouldn't have any of me. She wouldn't even tell me her name. Oh. Her name is Akudo. Akudo. Please, beautiful man, I beg you. Just leave her for me, please. Okay, uh, what did you call that your name again? My name is Azoka, the son of Hongwe. Azoka. Okay. I've heard you. Forgive me again, my son. And ask your wife to forgive me in my own behalf. I will, okay? Uh, I didn't know she was your wife. And tell her that it will not happen again. 
I will. Okay, I will. Uh, I was on my way. Ah, thank you. Thank you. me to do. Ebiri, she has taken him from me. The princess has taken him from me. What am I supposed to do? Fight for him. Yes. Fight for what your heart beats for. Your father is a very rich man. I'm one of the men that commands respect in this kingdom. Njide. He's a boy. You know you are beautiful. Tall and intelligent. Why don't you use what the gods blessed you with and get him for yourself? Get him to yourself. Make him yours. Yes. See, a river that wants to take the life of a child only looks for an excuse of his feet inside the river to take him. Why don't you fight for what your heart beats for? Don't give up. I know you will get him. Make him yours. Hmm? Hmm? Your Highness, Consider what both families stand to gain if my son marries your daughter, the princess. But uh, the princess and your son are already close friends. Or, or do you not know that? Your Highness, I do not speak of Ibezim. I speak of Unzube, my other son. He's the one I want to marry the princess um, for the betterment of our relationship. Uh, but that decision is for the princess to make. I cannot choose who she will marry. Your Highness, you are her father. You are the king. You are the one who has the authority to tell her who to marry or not to marry. Don't let her make a mistake. Yes, I am her father. But the most important to me here is her happiness. Whosoever she chooses to marry, is the one I will give the best. Rightly so, my king. But um, <laughs> honestly speaking, those children are my sons. But Uzube is better than Ibezim. That I can tell you. The princess will be making a very costly mistake if she chooses Ibezim over Uzube. But as long as there's love between them, there's no better thing than that. Azoka, the crown of your head, your wife with the wriggling waist, I take. A, A gift that, that cannot, cannot be returned. returned. Your desires for your wife, I take from you. Passion denied, and empty your heart, and for I shall be home. Eke, Ore, Afo, Onkwa, let the spirit of Oswabani gather and grant you that who should seek.
Greetings, Mother of Fruitfulness. Njide, you're welcome. Peace to your chi. Thank you, Mother. What brought you to my lazy this morning? I came to see you. The other time you said that you were busy and that was why you could not come and dine with me. So I decided to come this morning, especially knowing that our people do not go hunting on other days. You came to see me knowing that I will not go to hunt today. That I will not go to hunt today, does that mean I don't have any other thing to do? I know that you have so many other things to do. But all I ask for is just a little moment of your time. Please, Ibezim. Just a little moment. I am sorry for that which you see cannot be. For that which is supposed to be has already been. Must you turn a woman down because she poured out her heart to you? She said please, which means supplication. Hear her out. Mother, I am busy. Can't you see? What she said is huh? just for a little while. But I am busy. Give her a little time. Just hear her out. Please. Greetings, Sakudo. Iche, what are you doing here? Why are you like this? I heard you lost your husband. So like a good Obubara man, I came to console you. My husband has become one who has gathered back to his chi even before his journey on earth began. Iche, please leave my heart. Akudo. You get it all wrong. I actually came here to have you. Okay, here we are. I mean, what is it that you want from me? Sit. I'm coming. Okay. <coughs> okay. Okay. Oh, sorry, 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 sorry. Stop it! Stop it! Come on, stop it! Ibezim! Ibezim! Ibezim Wong! I'm in trouble.
My husband, Mujide, the daughter of Ichiawa, came here today. We came to see Ibezim. And from the look of things, she's deeply in love with him. So I, I, I want us to use this opportunity. Let's divert his mind to Unjide and remove the princess so that they will get married as soon as possible. Okay? Well, you are right. If uh, she truly has feelings for him, mm. then I'll do everything possible to unite them. Because... Nzume must marry the princess. He must become king. If we have to do something, do it first. We know the cricket time is short. I know. I know that the cricket moves only at night. It doesn't work in the daytime. And that the night is short. But I will do something as fast as possible. Because Trust me. I'll do it. Don't come away. Don't come away. Don't come away. Don't come away. I feel good work from you. Today. Such a beautiful maiden. I heard uh, you have some feelings for my son, Ibezim. And that he didn't even think it wise to return the same affection you have for him. Is it true? Yes, it's true. Hi! I've done everything possible to make him mine. But each time, my head looks like a spittle thrown into the water, hey. which cannot upset it. Huh. Hey. But do you truly love him? Yes, mother. Mm. My she cannot be at peace with another man, if not if it's him. Your chi will soon be at peace. Mm -hmm. Would you want me to make him like you? Then I will forever be indebted to you. <laughs> then I promise to make him yours. I will make him yours. I will try everything in my power to make sure you have the love of your life and the dreams you have. Thank you, Che. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you, Mother. It's okay. Well, that's not enough. I expected you to really rejoice. <laughs> I'm so happy. <laughs> I don't know what to do. Yeah, do whatever you want. Hola. <laughs> you needed to see how Ibezim was crawling, kneeling, and begging in Judeca. Hey! Hey! You needed to see how Ibezim was kneeling, brawling and begging in Jideka. Hey, yeah? So, my ears are itching. What did Njide now say? Njide said that she can only accept him if he says no to that useless princess. <laughs> Guess what he said? What? He said yes! Wow! This is wonderful. Oh, oh, oh. greetings, my princess. Greetings, my princess. Calm down and take it easy. It's just a rumor. I do not see him doing all that the rumor said. It's just a means to discredit him before you. It is true, Your Highness. It may just be a rumor. Please take it easy. Please. Your Highness, Ibezim truly loves you. It's just a rumor. Please. Your Highness. How did it go? <laughs> you needed to have seen her face. Mm -hmm. She looked older than the tortoise. <laughs> yes! And I know that after now, she will never go near Ibezim again. Mm -hmm. Not in her lifetime. Yes! 
That's what I want. If it is supposed to be mine and not hers. Mm -hmm. Yeah, We've done our own part. Hmm? It's now left for you to do yours once your father and your brother returns from their journey. I know I will not forget. I, I thank you so much. Thank you. I'm so happy. <laughs> That's a <laughs> Tell me there are no rumors. Tell me it's not true. I, I don't understand. What is not true? Oh, stop the pretense. Tell me it's not true. My dear, I don't understand what you're talking about. Ibezim, the rumor is everywhere on how you went back in India to accept you into her bosom. <laughs> I'm not good enough for you, right? Why are you laughing? Answer me! Can the eagle wish to become a cockerel? Can the river flow up hills? How can I leave a woman like you for Njideka? Am I stupid? See, my dear, you're not just a princess. You're gifted with wisdom and beauty by the gods. So tell me what I will seek in Njideka that the gods has not blessed you and endowed you with in folds. Tell me. Nothing. Uh, Nothing, my love. For a moment, I thought you had left me for her. Uh, it is only death that can take me away from you. <laughs> See, my love for you is like the morning stars. Like the morning dew. Very fresh and soft. <laughs> <laughs> you see? That's why I love you. You're comparing yourself with Njideka. How can? It's impossible. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, like, I like seeing you happy. I know. Hey, try it again. Um, wh where are your mates? Njideka. Njideka. Have I not warned you? to stay away from you. See, the lizard's love for a cracked wall does not make it the owner. Leave me alone. Njide, let this be the last time you and your little chicks will gossip with my name. Because by then, you will see the other side of me. And once again, as you can see, what you've been gossiping about cannot split us. Rather, it makes us strong. Mm -hmm. hmm? So, take a heed to my word and leave me alone. No. Okay? Leave us alone. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Your Highness, your summer was rather urgent. I hope all is well. <laughs> Why I asked to see you is that each time I see my daughter, Princess Akuchi, and your son, Ibezi, I always feel that I need a woman. I, I, after all, I, I am not that old. I, I need a woman who will be by my side. I want to take a new wife. <laughs> Your Highness, that's a good thing. Mm -hmm. Yes. I mean, sometimes we think the king does not have desires. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, Your Highness, I will um, send word around mm -hmm. and make sure we get you one that is suitable of your personality. Oh, <laughs> thank you so much. <laughs> thank you. See, mm -hmm. that was why I decided to let you know first before I inform anybody. I know you will help me find the perfect one. You're right, Your Highness. Mm. You know, I have eyes like an eagle. Yeah. I can search out the ones that are good enough I, to be I, called the queen. I trust you. <laughs> I trust you. <laughs> hey. okay. Thank you. 
Now, which farmland is about to be ravished by the locusts that kept my husband this quiet? You've been in this mood since you came back from the palace. You go make him. He wants to take another wife, so he wants me to get a suitable bride for him. Ah. <laughs> uh -uh. Is that why you've been this quiet? Would have said it now. Huh? Uh, so you're talking like this. Do you have anyone in mind? <sighs> Which better bride can we give than Njide? The daughter of Ichiawa. Njide. Huh? You know she's very respectful. And I know she will convince the king for the princess to marry Nzube. After a while, she will leave the king and marry Ibezim, the one she loves. Oh, you think this thing is so easy? Do you think she will agree to this? Eh? A woman in love. A woman in love can do anything. Really? Uh -huh. So how come you have not done anything for me, sir? Now you say you are in love. Anyway, that aside, I'm going to see her. Mm, go and see her. Don't give our love and. Ah, ah. But she leave the duke something for me at this stage. <laughs> Let me go and see her now. And go. I'll tell me thank you. I'll give you a bit of Thank idea. you. Give me your phone number when I come back. Uh -huh. <laughs> I didn't think of this. So. You should have told me. Maybe I will need to catch you. Why you cook your phone bottle? Ishe, I don't want any other plan from you. The last one you gave me almost dragged my father's name to the mud. That's because those your overzealous friends overacted. This one that I have for you now is the best for you. Just wait. All you have to do is to wait and hear. And what is it? Good. How would you feel being the king's consort? You want me to marry the king? It's not about wanting you to marry the king, but knowing what you will gain when you marry the king. You will no longer be ordinary Njide. You will now be Her Royal Majesty Queen Njideka. <laughs> One, the Ukuleze of this land. In that case, when you are walking, everybody will bow to you. Your word will become law. Anything you tell the king is what will happen. Njide. Never. There is no way I'm going to marry the king and allow Princess Akuchi have my Ibezim. Never. It all boils down to having Ibezim. This is a strategy for you to have Ibezim. Let me tell you, when you marry the king, you will be by his side. You will become a decision maker because you will influence the king. You will be the Okuleze one. Anything you say, the king will hear. So, you will force him to choose a man for his daughter. And of course, he will choose Nzube, my second son. And when that happens, a Missy Bezin will be free without a woman. Then you can leave the king and go and marry Bezin. Simple. <laughs> Ichi, eh? how does this sound to you? Sweet, melodious, beautiful. <laughs> that after the king has taken my womanhood, yeah. and Ibezim will still accept to marry me, and the king will allow me to marry Ibezim. Let me tell you something. I will try to shock you. The king will not lay with you even when he marries you. The king will not lay with me? How do you mean by the king will not lay with me? Mm. Njide, mm? wait. If I must get you right, he wants you to marry Igwe. His highness, Igwe Omekaago. Mm -hmm. He said that if I do that, I will not be able to convince the king to pronounce Uzube as the princess's husband instead of Ibezim. After that, I cannot leave the king and marry Ibezim. Mm. Akoko! Akokifu! How does that sound to your ear? Njideka! Imukwanya! Okay. Wait. Let me remind you. Maybe you have forgotten. If Igwe marries you, Definitely, he will lay with you and take your womanhood. Njide, let me ask you. Which man in this kingdom, or even our nearby kingdom, will get married to a maiden who he did not disflower? Who? 
I asked him that. And he said that. <laughs> it's a simple thing. I always have strategies. I will make the king become a vegetable. His followers will never respond every time he wants to live with you. In that way, you will have a reason to leave him. Then go and marry your heartthrob, Ibezim. Then we'll have Ibezim and Nijide forever. <laughs> How many times did I call? Two times. Three. Oh, I added Oto Oto to it. So you actually accepted to it. What is a perfect plan than this? Okay. The eight ones try without legs, but they usually have the help of the rain. Hmm. You see this plan? This plan is the rain for me to thrive on and have the man that I have always loved in my entire life. Hey, what do Hey, Jide. I thought you have always dreamed big. I thought you have always set a higher standard for yourself. Yeah? No wonder they say that anybody that did not properly suck her mother's breasts, you do not need a suit sayer to know that she is a half baked woman. I do not understand. Wait, are you trying to call me half baked? Mm -hmm. Of course, that is what you are. Because you are acting like one. Huh? Wait, let me ask you. Which is better? Is it being with Ibezim or getting married to his highness, Igwo Mekago, and bearing him a son? A son who will succeed him when he is no more. Thereby making you the mother of the king, Niwe. Are you saying that? I am saying that okra does not grow for those that have value for it. Huh? My good friend, you know I will not deceive you. Hey? Marry the king and bear him a son. Oh, do you not know that right now, whoever marries Princess Akuchi will automatically become the king? Yes, because our king does not have an heir to the throne. So marry him. If you marry him and give him a son, he will automatically be grateful to you forever for keeping his kinship and his lineage. Not just that. You'll be called Nigwe. Eh? Nigwe. His Highness will be coming to you. Your Highness! Your Highness! <laughs> Thank you. Uh -huh. Thank you, Billy. You see? You see why I call you my best friend? <laughs> and you know what? If I truly become the Queen, I will now make you my personal advisor. Uh -huh. Yes, you're my best friend. Personal advisor? Yes. Thank you, Your Highness. Oh! <laughs> wait, wait. Did you just call me Your Highness? <laughs> that sounds good! Oh my God. <laughs> because very soon you will become Your Highness. <gasps> your Highness! <laughs> your Highness! <laughs> your Highness! <laughs> your Highness belong! <laughs> oh, don't you said you have found a wife for me so soon. Yes, your highness. I had to search all around. I went to the extreme to get this particular one. <laughs> your highness, the rainy season is coming and I know that you will need somebody to warm your side of the bed. Oh, you're right though. But I wanted you to take your time to find someone that will uphold the name of the Soya family. Uh, uh, not the one that will bring disgrace to it. You're right, Your Highness. But what other choice could be better than the daughter of Ichiawa? Oh, yes, I'm talking about that fair, beautiful maiden. Oh, yes. I mean, she was born into wealth, and her father is a man of high reputation. 
That fair maiden. Mm -hmm. Did she agree to be my consort? I wouldn't be here talking to you, Your Highness, if she had not agreed to be your wife. <laughs> All you need to do now is to make preparations to go and see her people. Hey, that maiden is so beautiful. Excellent. Uh, Ichi, once this marriage goes through, I will reward you abundantly. Thank you, Your Highness. Mm -hmm. You are a very generous man. My daughter. No. I do not want you to hear this from outside. I want to take a new wife. You know, ever since your mother died, it has been just both of us. No. Yes. That is very good. Mm. You need a woman in your life. Mm. But have you found anyone? Oh, yes, yes. Ichi, Ugumba, help me to pick the right one. <laughs> no. Yes. You sound really true. Uh huh. If I may ask, Father, mm -hmm. who is this beautiful maiden that has captured your heart? Who is she? She is Ndideka, the daughter of Ichiawa the merchant. <laughs> You don't seem to be pleased with my choice. Father. Yes. Did she accept to be your wife? Yes, she did. But is there something you need to tell me? She's a beautiful maiden. Thank you. <laughs> but I hope. She will live up to the honor of this household. I hope so, Father. My love, the words that lie unspoken in your lips can melt a jock rock. You've been keeping quiet since we came here today. Your heart is... Your heart is heavy like someone whose chi is confused of what the day holds. Tell me what disturbs you. Tell me, let me your thoughts. Maybe I can provide a shooting bomb for you. My father wants to take another wife. That is good. That is good. You should be happy for him. He raised you up since your mother the queen died. I know. But my worry is not because he wants to get another wife. My worry is the maiden involved. Who is this maiden that is worrying the eagle of Obubara kingdom? She is Ujideka. The very same one you know. Then, that is nice. Yes. Because if she marries the king, she will stop disturbing us. And we will be free and live our lives. Can't you see that? I know. But I have there's this deep feeling inside of me that tells me she is up to something very bad. My love. You are pure. Hmm? Your chi is strongly with you. Someone whose chi is with you climbs Kokobo tree with her back. Relax and be free with your heart. Your chi is strengthened with you. Huh? Thank you. <laughs> 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 I greet you all, my elders. Igwe. Igwe. I also thank the gods for their unending benevolence over us all. See? For they have already shown us the signs of what the season How the season will end. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yes. Your Majesty, I agree with you. Uh, looking at the moon, one is at peace with himself. <laughs> because it is always a sign of something good and better coming to us. Oh, my elders. 
We all know that with a little drop of rain, just one drop, mm. the earth will forget how long it has longed for water. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. That's true. Yeah, yeah. And uh, a woman that dances naked in the market square is not just there for nothing. Either the spirit that made her mad is there, or the one that wants to heal her is present. Oh, mm -hmm. oh yeah. Yeah. yeah, you are right. That's true. Once again, mm -hmm. Your Highness. Because when a woman does not tie her wrapper properly while running, the wind will blow. <laughs> and her nakedness <laughs> will be <laughs> <so bizarre>. <laughs> 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 Um, My elders, uh, the reason I call this meeting is to let us know that uh, I want to take Another woman. Mm. Uh, I have stayed long enough in the cold since my wife, uh, uh, the great queen, died. I, I think I have mourned her long enough. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. 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 Your Highness, the way you sounded, it is like you have already found the maiden. Oh, oh, oh yeah. I found one. Oh, <laughs> if I may ask, uh, what is the name of uh, uh, this maiden? I believe that she should be a uh, daughter of one of the honorable members of this kingdom. Oh, oh, yes, she is. <laughs> she is uh, Ichi, our wife's daughter. Oh, 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 but you will prefer the above, uh, Your Majesty. Uh, Ishihawa has traveled there for his business trip. And as we all know, <coughs> no one is sure of where he will be by now with his business uh, colleagues. Uh, 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 no water. I know where he is. Uh, uh, and I have sent words to him already. Uh, <laughs> as soon as he returns. We will go and pay the dowry. Oh, 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 Your Highness, congratulations. 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 May the wisdom of the gods continue to stand resolute with you. Uh, yeah? Your father, where can I find him? He's inside with some of his friends. Uh, okay, let me see. Okay. You are looking so beautiful. <laughs> Thank you, Ishe. <laughs> All right. Mm -hmm. Beautiful queen, I will keep my promise. Okay. <laughs> you are looking so beautiful. Thank you, my princess. <laughs> Soon, you will no longer be addressed as Injibe, but Queen Injibe. That is, you will soon become my stepmother. And I believe we bury the hatchet and move on now that we are going to become family. Of course! Yes, why not? We will bury the hatchet because we are now family. Thank you, my princess. I believe you are here to see my father. <laughs> oh no! I'm here to see you. Like I said, you are looking so beautiful. Thank you. <laughs> go ahead, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> My queen. <laughs> <laughs> so
Father. Bless thee, my child. Hope you had a great day. Yes, Father. What about you? Uh, yes. It's a day that I will live the rest of my life to reminisce on. <laughs> Angele, how are you seeing your new home? I hope we welcomed you in the best possible way. Yes, my princess. Thank you for all your efforts to make today a success. And I hope by the girls, someday, I will show some kindness. <laughs> Looking after my father here alone will equip you of that responsibility. Then consider it done. It does. I will look after him. Um, Chai. Father. Can you please excuse us a little for us to... Uh, you know what I mean. <laughs> <laughs> no problem, Father. I only came to check on your new wife here. But I can see you both are fine. So, I will take my leave. And I will leave you in the hands of the gods. Let the spirits watch over you. You too, my child. You two are very close. You two are very close. She's my only child. Respect her in this palace. And your days will belong here. Mm. <laughs> uh, yeah. Could you go in there and call me the Queen Njide? Thank you. What was it? Njide, it's Point been a long... Correction. Your Highness, Queen Ejide, you must address me to my new title. Um, Your Highness, um, it's been three market days since you moved into the palace, and I've not heard a word from you. You desire to hear from me, your Queen. Now listen, Uche Ugumba, or whatever you call yourself. When a parrot expects its claws, to be as sharp as that of the eagle, that parrot will not only be ungrateful to Ischi, but will one day become a plaything for children. Now listen, I am not your servant that you should be sending on errands. Has it come to this? We, we had a pact, and that pact must be upheld. Or oh, are, are you no longer interested in marrying my son, Ibezim? First, we made no part. Second, I am staying in the palace to be a son for the king. And my son is going to become the next king of this kingdom. And not that arrogant, useless son of yours. How dare there. you speak to me in that manner? How dare you? Listen, that the antelope is beautiful will be found out when it finds itself in the burning pot of a hunter or in the jaws or claws of a lion. We need a pact. Don't forget that. Are you threatening me? Well, yes? um, well it's not that it's something we can discuss. I mean, sometimes people get annoyed. I mean, but you know, it's not. Now listen, Uche Ugumba. From now on, our meeting must always be in the presence of my husband, the king. Wow. You say so. Wow. It's okay. It's okay. But remember, the lizard's love for cracks in the house does not mean he's the owner of the house. He who runs away lives to fight another day. Oh, 
Goomba, your heart is sorrowfully bitter. When a man possesses the venom of a cobra and the strength and swiftness of the tiger and the craftiness of a tortoise, the man is born not to reign among mortals, but of the spirit. Yet you sorrow even when you had all those powers. Great to serve What is mine has been taken from me. A pact was made and a pact was denied. That wish was made to be must be, so that what could be would be. What do you seek for? I seek for what belongs to me to be given back to me and then for consolation or consideration for any denial. What you wish is yours so that your offering must be accepted. <laughs> Thank you, great one. Did you see them? Who, my queen? Never mind. Are you sure that was not a dream? My husband. Why should I begin the day with lies to you, my husband? What I saw was real. It was real, your highness. But that is difficult to believe. My husband. My king. Please, I want you to do something for me. Something that will not only save this royal palace, but the entire Obubara kingdom. And what could that be? Have you heard of Ndinato, the three brothers who we are gifted by the gods to identify evil? Yes, I've heard of them. Story goes that they are very powerful. Do you want me to send for them? Yes, my king. Please, send for them. Mm. Please. Mm. Have you lost your senses of greeting? Or has your miserable father now joined the several to create men like me? Hi. Eh? Don't you know how to greet your, greet your elders? Hey! Look at them, Mumu Ogogi. Hey, Bidi. Hey, my sister. Do you know what stupidity is? Tell me, oh. <laughs> stupidity is when one is half in Brussels. And still expected to be called home. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Wait. Are you referring to me? Wait, are you you are laughing at me? No. We are laughing at our 
our great grandfather. Mm -hmm. I'm not here. Mm -hmm. Of course, we are laughing at your chief for being stupid with you. <laughs> Tell me, let me warn you. Don't try this thing next time, oh. Half in better, you're looking for respect. Okay. Since you have lost your <laughs> Look at them. You're running. Don't worry. Next time I'll catch you. Very soon now, when I get when I become the way you people start flocking around me, begging me to marry you. Then I'll show you I'm the Uzube the catapultist. Dala. Greetings from our king, Igbome Kago, elder of Obubara. You have journeyed far. You need to rest a little. After then, we can talk. Hello. Well, you now go with guys and mates. I said, Neil! What did I say? Now listen. You look like son of an evil man. You might be a fool, but you are not his husband. Mama, eh? Nijide. Nijide, what are you doing? I've brought me and back again and I will lock you up in the power store. You must address me as your highness, the queen. Your highness. Thank you, son of the earth. What has my brother done that you punish him? Buy this fool to the confinement of your friends and give him a proper training. For next time, it upsets any daughter of this kingdom. I, Finijide, will make sure that he is punished according to the custom of this kingdom. Please. I know. But the next time. For Bubara, go back to your king and tell him that we will come. But your people will set us a place deep in the forest, for we do not dwell with mortals. Our ways are different from their ways. Our king will be most grateful. We will do all that you have said. And one more thing. We must be allowed to walk as we please. Okay. No problem. Go back to your king. On the fourth night, you will be in your kingdom. I will deliver the message. She said all that to you? Hmm. She even said more. You have given that girl the fangs to bite us. Hey! Hmm. I love because when a little child dances the Ajoro dance, <laughs> he stops and looks at the swiftness of his legs and his waist. 
moving to the rhythm of the song. He does not know that that old man with waist pain nodding to the rhythm of that same song was once swifter than him. I wonder. Look at the alligator, relying on his strength and his depthness. No matter how strong he is, he can never be called a crocodile. Hmm. Warn her. She should not then mistake the wrinkles on the face of a tortoise as old age. It's not old age. It is wisdom. Full of wisdom. <laughs> uh, I, Ugumba, made her. She should never forget that I cannot make her. You never. Have, you have to do whatever you can. My son must be the king. The king in this kingdom. I know what to do. I know what to do. Makaria. <laughs> I know what to do. I appreciate your coming, great ones. You must be weary and tired. I will ask my servants to prepare a place for you to rest. We are not here to marry your highness. I know, but your feet must be hurting from the long journey. Your highness, we do not dwell in the company of men. Set us a place deep in the forest where we can have uninterruptible communications with the gods. Your highness, my friend, I was about to send for you, my friend. Highness, you sent for me at all without letting me know. Does the king have to consult you before he does anything? My husband, it's like you have given Iche here so much privilege. We need to rest now, your highness. All right. We have already made preparation. Cool. That was the man that killed our parents. Can I? A man cannot run past where his chi has stopped. Remember, our gift is not for vengeance. <laughs> but it's evil! It's evil! And we all know it! Why? Why? Why did we let him go? Fashion. Can I? Precept by precept. That is how the ghost works. I know. I know that. But if you know, allow the ghosts, the ghosts of Annie, the ancient deity, at their will. Yes, great one. The hesitation of the vulture is because it's unsure if the carcass is real and not a hyena that is feigning death just to trap it. Great ones, the Nato people are now with us in the kingdom. And you're scared? Quite profusely. The vulture never misses the smell of the carcass, visibly or invisibly. The partridge thinks itself a peacock. 
and the pigeon urges it on. Whose side is the all, day or night? Fear not, men of the night bed, for the souls of light never identify you. Through the spirit of perdition, into bewitching you to do such evil. What the offense? Your Highness, they were trying to defile this meeting in the bush where we apprehended them. How are we sure that they are speaking the language of truth? Or they are trying to make this up to impress you? When the truth is about to be told, the stubborn he goat gives reasons why meeting with each mother is not a crime against the earth. Your Highness, <laughs> I am sorry that we have. Defy so many maidens in this land. Yes, yes. And beyond. I'm sorry that we have seen against this land. Yes, we are sorry. Yes, yes. Your head is peace. Don't take our lives. Yes. Your Highness. They have committed an unforgivable crime against this kingdom. And their penalty is death. Hey, Move it. Your Highness, please. Your Highness, we are sorry. Your Highness, we are sorry. Move it. Your Highness, please. Your Highness, please. Stand up and move. Your Highness, please don't take our lives. Your Highness, please, we are sorry. Your Highness, please. Stand up. Your Highness. Your Highness, please. Your Highness. <laughs> My leprosy cleave to your generation for asking me such a stupid question. Iche, what have I done? Why did you go and cut the plantain that was on my land? Who sent you? Iche, it was not me, it was my son. And I've sent him to return the plantain back to you. I am sorry about that, please. Mm -hmm. It was your son. No problem. If you cannot tame your son, if you cannot control your son, I will do that for you. Huh? Yeah, I will do that for you. Iche! Iche! How are you?
Salutation, your highness. Greetings, sons of Ali. What is his offense? Your highness, he was caught stealing at Ichiawa's hut earlier today. Did I hear his name? Yes. We caught him stealing your father's hut. My father's hut? Who sent them? Uh, well, that's not necessary now. It's, it's obvious that he's a thief. The items are with him and you can see. They should just take him away and execute him. But your highness, we should know who sent him. Oh, no, no. The important thing is that he did not get away. Well, yes, yes. Let him not always put judgment on him. Take him away. Please, it's okay. Stop crying. No amount of tears will bring back your tears. Stop crying. There's no amount of tears that you shed that will bring him back. Stop crying, please. Stop crying. 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 Oh, we know that you <laughs> stop crying. 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 What did you see? The land has been defiled with blood and the earth seek for vengeance. Then, vengeance shall the earth receive. Let's go. Can bring the food now. Let me eat and go for the meeting. Eh? Yeah. Must I die before you bring it? Hey. What are you, sons of perdition, doing in my heart? Ichi, the blood of the innocent you shed. Cry for vengeance. I do not understand what you are talking about. Will you leave my compound before I unleash the wrath of Osabali on you? Ichie, the millipede pride itself for being special. That is because Osabaluwa himself created it with many legs. Yet, sons of men like you, Ichie, trampled on it. <laughs> Why? Stop, 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 I will confess, I will confess, I will confess. Hey! Stop, stop, let me confess. Let me confess, let me confess, let me confess, let me confess. Let me confess. I killed him. I killed him. He killed him. Because his mother refused me to sleep with her. 
because of the sun. Uh, please, in that uh, that uh, forgive me. It will happen again. Forgiving you will be a sin to the Mother Earth. For the Earth itself wail and cry for your blood. And that shall the Earth receive. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, no, oh, 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 You promised us that they will not harm us. Yet Mbogo is dead. He was born to death. Their power is something you cannot understand. For you to defeat them, you have to travel to Amambere River to see the blind witch. Only she can help you people. Huh? Amambala. Why are you stopping? Amambala River is a den of death. No one has ever gone there and come back alive. So, for the fear of the rumors you heard, you do not want to continue with me. You prefer to stay here and let those three burn you alive in this kingdom? Anyway, it's your choice. You can choose to stay or choose to follow me. I'm gone. I want to, I want to talk to you. So what I want to tell you. No.
the prolonged preamble of her music makes the dancers wee. You said you have something to tell us. Ever since you have been smiling and our ears have been waiting to hear what has made you to be so happy this day. <laughs> Father, maybe the news is great that she does not know how to let it out. Oh, then let us start from somewhere. Exactly. Are we not family? We are. We understand. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I am with a charge. Magadi, the royal physician, told me that when I went to see her earlier today. Oh, this is good. I'm so happy. Father. Ghosts of my ancestors, I thank you. Father. Mm. <laughs> Men of Obubara Kingdom, what you seek cannot be, for Seblua is the creator of it. Great one, are you saying that nobody can destroy this Nato people? No one can destroy them except themselves. How do you mean? Uh, please, uh, great one, uh, clear the air. We, we are confused. The only thing that can destroy them is when a mortal sees their naked face. Then their powers shall leave them and they shall become like every other man. Unless that, not even Equensu, that father of mischief can stop them.
what are you saying? Do you know that since Umako came to our land, evil things have stopped happening. Everyone is so scared of hurting one another, or like before. <laughs> Look at what our friend is saying. Who wants to die? No, who? Knowing very well that anybody who tries to do anything evil, they will find him. What are you now saying? I even hear they used to disappear and appear. And that's why they keep catching all the evil ones at the spot. Odun, why didn't Igwe bring them on time? No, 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 no. Come to think of it. If they have been here long before now, this kingdom would have been saved a very long time ago. Yes, yes, but all the same. Thanks to him that you brought them. Yeah. No time is too late insofar as something good is done. Of course. It's your cuckoo. It's all right. Something left my body. Someone has seen your face. We have to go back to the river because we have been compromised. Then we must go now. Yes. Let's go. Let's go. Nobody has a pact with me and breaks it. Your integrity will be broken. Yes, worry. You will steal. Your personality will be shattered. yet. I said stop! She has never acted like this before.
Abomination in this kingdom. Take her away. What, what, what just happened? You stole my cassava. You stole your cassava? Yes. Me. Me. So, me. Me. Your Highness, she has already confessed to the crime. Let justice be done. Let her face her punishment. You are still the king. You can overrule this decision. Remember she is with your child. Please, father. It can only be done if you people are ready to rain down the wrath of army on this kingdom. Death and calamities shall swallow this land. Should justice be hindered. You are in like this for the past two days now. What happened was unfortunate. But Njide I know will not commit such a tedious crime. Please. I want you to be strong and sort out the reason behind all this. Mm. 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 Father. Oh. Guards! Be fast! Uh, uh, take it to his chambers immediately! Uh, take it to his Yes. You, go and call a call for me. Take him to his chambers. <clears throat> How is he? I've played my part. What is required of him is to find his chief and make peace with them. Father, please do not leave me. You know you are all I've got in this world. Please, enough. Please stay with me. Fight it. Fight it and leave. I know you can fight it. Please do not leave me. <laughs> Please, enough. Thank <laughs> you. 
Please, please, my seat for my sake. My seat, my seat. <laughs> I'm still finding it very difficult to believe this is real. For Lolo to have asked us to stop fixing her hair so she could go steal from Ishe Ogumba's crop. Well, if you ask me, this is not ordinary. I strongly have this belief that something like witchcraft must be involved in this. You're right. But it is not ordinary. She is such a nice woman. I'm still wondering who could have wished her such wickedness. He drunk and join you. But one thing I believe is that whosoever it is will definitely face death. The final journey of every man. By then, she'll be waiting for him or her at the junction of death. Go, go, we'll join you. Go, go, we'll join you. She's only trying to be the most precious, cold Your Highness, you are too quick weak to come out. Why don't you just stay inside? Your Highness. Where is my daughter? You! Call the princess for me. If there was any commission, you could have just told him. Greetings. Your father, His Majesty, demands your presence at once. Really? Your Highness, take it easy. Father. My daughter, you look pale. Father, I'm fine. What are you still doing outside? Guards! Uh, no, it's alright, it's alright. I want to tell you something. Look for a man whose chi and your chi are in agreement, and I, I will place your union hmm? because I am not sure if I will rise from this sickness. No, no, no. Do you say that, Your Highness? If you do not rise, who then shall oversee the affairs of this, com mm. this kingdom? Yes. Uh, yes, yes, yes. Father, you will make it. Mm. You're not going to leave me all alone in this world. So you will make it. Yes. I have been praying to Sebeloa to grant you life in place of death. Mm, thank you. What? Please, make sure you bring the man as soon as possible. Mm? You'll be fine. <laughs> How can you be looking for what to do when what to do is right in front of you? If you refuse to tell a man that he's um, ugly, you will end up proposing to your wife. Honestly, I don't know what to do. I have three problems. One, I don't want Ibezim to be king. Two, Princess Akuchi is not even looking in Zubay's way. Third, and the one that is the worst. Uzube himself is not helping issues either. He doesn't want to be responsible. Then become the king. Huh? Uzube will inherit it from you. You want me to become king? Uh -huh. How? Kill the princess. That news alone will kill the king. You are the uno. Automatically, you are the mess to sit on that throne. Automatically, you become the king. And this is called simple arithmetic. What are... Thank you very much. Tell me thank you again. Thank you. 
Are you going to? You're looking like you're in a hurry. Yes, I, I am. Please just go to the palace and wait for me. I'll meet you there. I'm oh, 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 but, but I, I can I can be of help to you. Let me let me follow you. No, 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 my love. No, just go to the palace and wait for me. I'll be there right away. There's something very important I need to do. But please tell me, where are you going to? Is your highness in, in trouble? No, no, no. Just go to the palace. I'll meet you there. I promise. Just go, go. Go, okay? Is the, is the king in trouble? the great deity of the earth and beyond. We, your sons, have come with a broken heart because we have compromised thy will. Have mercy, O Sebuloa. Have mercy, O Sebuloa. Have mercy, O Sebuloa. Thou sons of Osebloa, for how long shall you continue to soil the rivers of the gods with your tears and supplication? Great Annie, until our plea is heard by Osebloa and our burdens lifted from our shoulders, only then shall we wipe our tears with smiles on our faces. Sons of Osebloa. The bodies are yours to carry, for that is who you are, even before you were conceived in your mother's womb. Then, let the great deity that resides in heaven lift this risk that has cleaved to us like leprosy. Great Annie, please intercede on our behalf. <laughs> Sons of Osebloa, rejoice for the risk is lifted and your powers restored. 
Sort of a You must go to Obubara, for the evil is about to be hatched. Now rise and go. Thank you, great one. Thank you, great one. We will forever be accepted to you. Thank you, great one. Return our salutation or the one hey, that if you ask me, I don't know. But looking at her, she looks like one who is under respect. And then when you go, oh no, stop talking. Don't say the one that will bring your end one day. Huh? Let us go before you see okay. another one. Why? Your mouth. Talk, 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 talk. Yeah? You don't know that all these lips have here. Please take me. Make me feel like a real woman. Do you know what you asked me for, my princess? Yes, I know. I know. Please do not tell me down, else I will die. Please take me. Help me as you want. I want to feel the strength of your mouth okay, inside okay, of me. Okay, okay. If, if, if. If that's what you want. That's what I want. That's what I want. That's what I want. See, the princess says the way she was going to. No. And what of his highness? Is he alright? Yes. I just checked on him. He's sleeping. All right. Ah, uh, this is you're gonna need to stay with blood. Me begging you to take your one with else you kill yourself. <laughs> you have desecrated the royal family by deferring yourself even before you grace your husband's bed. No, 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 no. I didn't do this. Someone manipulated my maid. You have to believe me. Take her to the palace. She's an abomination that must be get rid of. <laughs> oh, I didn't do this. I'm 
Why? Why? Why did you have to do this evil before the throne? Why? But I didn't do it. I didn't do it just to believe me. I didn't do it. How can I commit such a crime against you and against the man I love? I can't sleep with this such a stranger. If I wanted to do it, I would have done it with the man I love. I didn't do it. Mr. Kuchi, there is no amount of tears you will shed that will assuage the evil you brought upon this kingdom. You must be buried alive to save the entire Ubuntu kingdom. I don't mean you need to let her kill me. I don't mean to let her kill you. I believe her. I believe you will not allow a stranger to lay you. <laughs> hey, Ibezim, don't wash your lay hand on her. Do not allow your fake feelings for her to cloud your sense of judgment. No one should lay hand on her. Don't beat yourself against the god. You have to kill me before you get to her. You have to kill me first. Ibezim. You only have one chance to drop that weapon or face the wrath of the gods. And you! The gods have already judged you for impersonating their own. Who are these people? We are the Inato, offspring of Oseblua. You tried to kill us, but the gods spared our lives. You liars! Your highness, they are lying! The real Inato you surely wear masks. I forbid Who are you! These? You do not call the ghosts liars. You will, you will please go for me. Please confess. Please, you no, no, confess. Please, please, go confess. Yes, man. No. Huh? Who is that boy that lives all alone in the forest of Odabia? I saw a hut and a boy there today. Yes. You saw someone at that forest? But how did you know it was a boy? I, I saw him urinating. And his face even looked familiar. His face looks familiar. That means you saw the face. Of course I saw his face. That's why I say he looks familiar. Oh. You saw the face. Listen, I want three of you to go there. Kill all those people. Kill them, take their clothes. Because now I am making you the new Nato. But, oh no, you know we cannot get a foot to them. Because they are extremely powerful. Not anymore. They have lost their powers. They have been defiled, Ogunma. How are you sure that they have been defiled? Have you forgotten what the Red Witch told us? The only way to destroy them is someone to see their faces. So, so how do you break the torches cell? No one has ever seen their faces because they are always wearing masks. My son Onsube swore to me that he has seen one of their faces. Huh? Yes. And he said that the face of the person he saw looks very familiar. In fact, he said that person is somebody of this kingdom. Mm -hmm. For no, in that case, we will gladly do it. So go in there. I will count on us. Go. Thanks, let's go. No one is in the hut. I've searched around the house, but there is no one in the house. 
the same. They have searched everywhere and there is no one here. They may have noticed someone have seen their faces and ran away. You have a point. Because if I'm the one, <laughs> I will run as long as my legs can carry me. I call a I call a the best thing we should do is for you to go and report to Gumba. I think it's necessary. It's all good, Nekwe. Yes. Give right. me a point. Yes, let's go. So, what happened? To Gumba. He searched everywhere. But we couldn't find them. The might have run. Well, that is good also. Now listen to me, three of you. I'm going to get you dressed like them. And then you become the new Nato. Okay? From now you start working for me. So get ready for that assignment. Thank you, Shia. Thank, 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 Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you, Shia. They run away. No problem. Now we have new Nato. Please, please. I beg of you. Please. Please, forgive me. Please, forgive me. Spare my life. I was just trying to make the kingdom right. I beg of you. Your Highness, we're best of friends. We plead for mercy when you do not know such words. Igwe, this man here, Ichi Egumba, is responsible for all the calamities and evils that have befallen this kingdom. And he shall face the wrath of the gods. Ugumba Atwebu, son of Ibinna, or springs of lion, you have failed the earth and your chief. You, your wife Ilodi, and Uzube has failed. Osebulu will find you guilty by death, and you shall be buried alive. Your Highness, I was just trying to make the kingdom right. God, Your Highness, go to his court and bring him to his son. And his wife. Now, leave my family out of this. Please, I was just trying to make the kingdom Take right. Take this evil man away. <laughs> 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 Let's go! Let's go! Hey, wait, my catapult. Let's go. 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 Oh, no, why hide me? Let's go. Let's go. Oh, why hide me? I'm going. Push out. Move. Come back. Come back. Please. Please bless them. I bless you with the blessings of the gods of Abubara. May your chi be in unison. Let the love that you have ever had continue to multiply.
Yeah, I don't want to be 